All right, kind of excited about this. We're going to be trying Endeavor OS and seeing if I can get it installed on this crappy laptop. And here we are again with Linux Mint and the update screen's on again. Man, they really want you to update this thing. When you have Pop OS, it just actually, I have Pop OS open right now. I like that setup right there. So it's not harassing me, it's not annoying. I'm really bad at updating. It's kind of why I'm a huge fan of Linux. I don't like to update things. I don't like the internet. <laughs> Maybe I'm old, but let's get into it. Let's see if I can figure out how to get Endeavor OS installed on this piece of junk laptop and get Steam installed, which I've learned so much. Thank you to everybody who's commented on the past two videos where I installed um, Linux Mint and Manjaro. I've got some new information i've learned that i don't have to install wine and somebody put a code in there that i should be able to install steam so i think i might be able to install endeavor with relative ease so let's see if i can do it all right i see all sorts of stuff here to click let's click this guy no nope, failing in life can't click anything uh -huh. download latest release oh there we go where do I download it? Uh, all right, let's try this. There, should we go? Should be good to go in a sec. Let's get back to this. All right, got my USB. Let's install it. Got Endeavor OS. Right click because we're on Pop OS. Bam. Oh, hasn't recognized it yet. Let's see what's going on here. There we go. Yeah. Next. There we go. We'll return once this is installed on this USB stick. Let's see if we can get it on here. All right, this is done. Let's finish it up here. Click done. Open you up. Eject. All right. Just reset the computer. Waiting to see Endeavor OS be picked up by that USB stick. Hopefully that works. That was pretty cool. That was incredibly fast, like incredibly fast, but let's, <laughs> we just clicked it. Let's not get too excited, let's not get carried away here. Honestly, it looks like it crashed. That kind of looks like, um, weird. Did I pick the wrong thing or something? I don't know. Can I hit enter here? No, it's, eh, it might have broke. I don't know what's going on. Hmm. Maybe I picked the wrong version of Endeavor. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that it's straight up crashed. Like, this has to be 100%. I'm going to go back to the Endeavor website and take a look. Very hard to see, but yeah, you just get like a, a thing up in the top corner and it just dies. So we'll try one other quick thing. Let I will see if I can find an older version install, installed on the USB stick and see if we can like get it past. Like I'm not getting any installer. Is this what Endeavor OS is? Seems strange to me because I've heard a lot of good stuff about this. It's this guy right here. So let's get into it. So you can see that I downloaded 22. I found Endeavor OS 21. Let's see if that one works. So yeah, old version, still get that same screen. The only interesting thing I noticed is if I power it down, I get that, but that's probably just it turning off. I don't know what's going on there. And I looked at here, I'm supposed to get that screen. And I kind of looked around online. I didn't see like this issue. So let's just call it a fail. Um, I'm not sure what I, did or I honestly don't even know what to do at this point so I'm just gonna end the video there so I hope you enjoyed my video but that was my failure install of Endeavor OS have a good day